Hey guys, what's up? I am Nikhil from dopemotions.com and welcome to this quick tip video. In today's quick tip, I am going to show you guys the best render settings for your Instagram stories. Using these settings, you can easily export your Instagram story animations from After Effects and post it on your Instagram profile. So without any further ado, let's get started. Alright, here we are in After Effects and as you can see, I have already loaded up my Instagram animation, Instagram story animation. So let's say I want to post this animation in my Instagram profile as a story. And if I hit Ctrl K on the keyboard so that you guys can see my composition settings which are 1080 by 1920 30 FPS. Normally the mistake that most of the people do is they go into composition, add it to render queue, then go to lossless set this to quick time and then render it but this way the instagram story animation is the file size of this video is going to be pretty big and it's not going to be too good for an instagram story because it's just 10 seconds you know the size will be 100 to 150 mb and this big size for a story is not good so what we need to do is i'm going to delete this i'll open up the composition that i want to render go into composition and add it to adobe media encoder so it's going to launch the media encoder CC. It's going to take a few seconds to load up. And there we have our project loaded up into the media encoder. Now, if I want to change any settings, I can go into match bitrate. Right now, the preset is set to match bitrate at highest bitrate. If you want, you can keep that and it's going to keep it at 12 MB, which is pretty okay, pretty nice. You can use the maximum render quality but if you want to make it a bit more smaller what you can do is you can switch to medium bitrate but i prefer setting it at high bitrate if you set to medium bitrate it's going to keep it at 3 mb but i think high bitrate 12 mb is not a problem so i can set this to high bitrate use maximum render quality and everything i'm going to leave it at default settings hit ok and then click on this icon to render the animation and then you will have your animation just 12 mb and you can upload it on your instagram you can you can send this video to your mobile phone by you know using, using a share it and then upload it on your instagram profile so that was a quick tip for today guys i hope this was helpful and if it was then make sure to follow me on instagram at dope.motions and i will see you guys in the next video till then take care thank you so much for watching and don't forget to stay raw stay creative